to the top this time for the Hoosiers. Lego looks to the right side, then comes back to the short side, and the pass is intercepted. Pass is intercepted. It's Juan Thornhill. Peace and Malcolm Cook, all backers getting involved in this ballgame. Third and six, Ben Kurt throwing. Pass is caught inside the 10 yard line. Zacchaeus stretching forward to the four yard line. And that good effort by number four takes it down to the four where it's going to be first and goal for the Wahoos. They empty the backfield for Ramsey. He'll throw on first down. Pass is caught. Sims spins out of one tackle, still on his feet, inside the 10. Inside the five, takes it to the end zone. Touchdown, Indiana. 29 yards on the score. So Cobbs takes it for a 29-yard touchdown. So Cobbs takes it to the house for the Hoosiers, and they've got their noses in front for the first time today. Have all three timeouts. Ramsey on the play action. Going to tuck it, going to run it inside the 20, 15, 10, 5, takes it to the house. Touchdown, Indiana. It's just a different threat. They had receivers down the field. Virginia may have been in man coverage that time because they were chasing guys around. Nobody close to Ramsey as he really just kind of walks into the end zone. Virginia showing blitz. And here they come. And they have got Ramsey for the sack. All the way back at the 11-yard line, like a bunch of crazed dogs, they went after the quarterback for the Hoosiers, and they got him. And then Indiana scored 17 unanswered points to take a 17-3 halftime lead. To the end zone, touchdown, virtually untouched, Jordan Ellis. And the Wahoos are back in the game. That well, wasn't the explosive 20-yard play, but it was explosive in the fact that he was able to get into the end zone. Not even a hand laid on him that time. They're knocking on the door, down 17. Here comes a blitz, swing pass, caught, five, end zone, touchdown, Joe Reed.